Hello and welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your weekly oracle messages reading. It will be from the 7th to the 13th of February 2022. And remember these are fairly concise readings where we pull oracle cards and look at what the energies are coming your way for the next week or so. Remember this won't be for everybody so just take what re resonates with you as always and without further ado I wish you a wonderful weekend and let's get straight into the readings. Scorpio let's see what we have for you. This is for Scorpio Sun Rune Sun Rune <laughs> Anna said it twice as well. Sun, moon rising and Venus. I was trying to say rising and moon at the same time, I think, which probably didn't sound very well. Okay, what do we have for Scorpio, please? Message for our lovely Scorpios. Oh, options. Maybe we have adjacent possibility. You've got options. Number 24. Community, number seven. Could be your work community, friendship. family again community is generally you know people within our environment whichever environment this is we have patience number 16 and bottom of the deck we have storm warning so something going on here Scorpio whatever this is again it might well be you're getting some advice from your friendship circle or family as well um, but there's certainly an energy of some kind of a reason to look at options. I feel you're considering your options. An energy of patience is needed here. But there is something to take note of here with the storm warning and maybe respond to. And it might well be for some of you. You're seeing, for example, if this is to do with a money career thing, you know, it might well be that you might be learning of some kind of change that's happening with your company for whatever reason and it's prompting you to take action to see what's out there. It might well be for some of you. Something affecting your community in some way. Again, maybe some kind of something that needs response an energy of patience seeing how to deal with it looking at the options evaluating the options and then maybe deciding on how to move forward i mean that could be anything let's have a look at storm warning for you number 10. i feel whatever this is you're considering your options here We have number 10, Storm Warning, Clouds on the Horizon. This card indicates a potential difficulty, either in the external world or within yourself and your emotional life. The difficulty is coming closer, and you may have already heard the rumblings of a potential problem around you. The caution here is to be conscious yet not fearful. Consider what's going on and look at the situation with calm clarity. Investigate your options and honour yourself and your intentions. Stand up for yourself and take action on your own behalf. As with all difficulty, even the worst storm passes. Always remember you have the power and the wisdom to handle whatever may come your way. I feel you're considering options in whatever way this means to you. And it's certainly indicating that you have more than the power that you need to deal with it and maybe bring positive change, you know, as a result of this, if you respond. I mean, these cards come out for a reason to prompt a response, right? You know, so or to guide, to give guidance, to prompt responses, maybe to signal something that you might already be aware of here. So I feel in this energy here, there's an energy of patience in all things. Don't, you know, n no knee-jerk reactions or anything. No impulsive decisions. But to calmly and concisely 
look at your options here and then decide on the way forward. It might well be for some of you, the universe is telling you that there are options around you, doors to open, could be in the form of opportunities, for example, to, do, to counter whatever this is. So act now. Okay, that is the message I have for you. Final message for Scorpio, please. Final message for Scorpio, please. We have dear, trust, approach the situation with a light heart. And I love this because we have the ghost dear here watching over all the other dear. So you're certainly being watched over and guided. Might well be why this message is coming to you right now. So let's see what else we get. We have Honeybee, Divine Feminine. You are being called on to rise. And we have Courage, Kangaroo. You are being tested. Have faith and stand in your truth. That is the message I have for you, Scorpio. If you enjoyed it, please do like, share and subscribe and I will see you next time. Thank you.